Hello, 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 hello. Are there people joining? Let me see. Mm, we'll copy this link and share it. Give me a second. Let me share the link. Actually, the thing is that the link, the previous link didn't work properly. So let me share this link. Yes, I'm sharing the groups so that people can join. We will wait for like five minutes. Mm, am I sharing it properly? Yes. Yes, perfect. People are coming in. Just just give give us some like five minutes. In the meanwhile, you guys can start asking me questions if you have. Uh, at the end of the session, I will be answering all the questions. First, I will introduce myself and then give you some uh, general information about Germany. Yes, just a minute. Hello, hello. Yes, there are viewers. There are viewers coming in. That's great. Just give me some time. I'm sharing the link and let people join and then we can definitely start. Yes, people are coming in. That's great. I'm sharing more. Just give me some time. Today, I will answer all your questions. Hi, Paxton Stark. Hi. Also, uh, if you guys don't know, we have WhatsApp community group. You can join it. Mm, I'll share you the link in the chat if I can. Mm. This is our group, the recent one. Copy link and I will paste it in the chat if I can. Sorry, guys, pardon me. This is the first time I'm live. So if I make some mistakes, please forgive me. WhatsApp group link. Or Germany. And I will pin this comment so that all people can see this. Okay. So guys, let me introduce myself. My name is Amir Vadekar and I have been in Germany since three years now. I've completed my master's uh, here in Germany from RWTH Aachen and I currently I am doing a full-time job in Dresden as a project manager. 
people are joining the link is working i guess mm, yes more people are coming in just give me some more minutes guys this is my first live so there is a slight delay and there was a long uh, like a wrong link shared so sorry for that sorry for the miscommunication mm -hmm. yes and today i will answer all your questions so please stay tuned if you guys have any questions please ask me yes okay so yes people have people are joining in people are joining in so let me introduce myself again for new people i am amir wadekar and currently i am in germany i have completed my masters here in germany uh, in engineering management and currently i am doing a full time job here at dresden germany so uh, i will brief you about uh, some points i have noted some points and useful information about germany so quickly i will share with you some general information and from there on we can answer all your questions by the time people will still join in okay so basically if you are planning for your masters or uh, or bachelors or phd in germany why germany is a good choice there are some reasons so uh, talking about the economy it's the fourth biggest economy in the entire world okay and it's the largest economy in europe uh, believe me guys europe has uh, like the most uh, stable ec uh, economy all over the world and germany as a country also has uh, one of the most stable economies in the world the next reason is uh, best education system absolutely uh, germany provides top class education system with no tuition fees so uh no tuition fees by no tuition fees i mean that uh, you don't pay anything to learn there are some semester contributions which are nominal like 300 euros which can be easily covered by part time jobs but apart from that most of the universities like the public universities offer courses free of cost uh then i will answer all your questions i am seeing all the questions so at the end of uh this information i can answer all your questions just bear with me like uh, 10 minutes not more than that i will not bore you okay uh this is really an interesting information uh it has the lowest unemployment rate so as you guys are planning for germany i'm sure that uh, most of you will be working here and staying here for quite a long time so uh germany has the lowest unemployment rate so that like the government takes care that uh, none of us are unemployment when are in germany when we are in germany and also regarding the job opportunities uh, there are like more than 8 lakh uh, jobs currently in germany across various domains so uh, you guys already know that germany is the mechanical hub or the automobile hub but believe me guys it is not only the mechanical hub or automobile hub it has been diversifying germany has been diversifying into various sectors for example uh, currently robotics then it and uh, uh, like ai these sectors are in boom uh, in germany also if you go towards cologne side pharma sectors are also in boom uh, next point uh, most of your questions will be answered uh, in this information i believe so if uh, if you Uh, if you have still have uh, any questions we will uh, cover it at the end of the session so may, many of you guys ask that can i apply if i have low cgpa or maybe you have gaps in between the semesters or maybe you are 50 years of age and still can you apply is is a very uh, common question you ask on my whatsapp groups also can you do multiple masters uh, is there any scope for particular field so answer to all the questions is if you have low cgpa then also you can apply for german universities the reason is that the reason i am telling you that 
is that because most of the universities here they don't consider only your marks okay i know uh, coming from an indian system it is a bit hard to believe that germany not only concentrates on marks yes marks are important grades are important but your extracurricular activities your work experience then how well you write your sop how well you write your lor everything matters a lot okay so low cgpa if you have low cgpa no worries don't get disheartened still you can apply okay uh, for new students uh, i have been uh, our whatsapp group Uh, link you can join our community we have a huge community of students who are interested in uh, studying in germany working in germany so i i will say that please uh, join our group we have we share valuable informations there as well so i hope that uh, these common questions are clear so there are top challenges as well okay the challenge is that no proper guidance okay the reason i started this youtube channel was that uh, you know i i saw that there is no proper guidance uh, when it comes to you know studying in germany so i started to uh, started my youtube channel in order to show life in germany i make travel videos as well you can check it out uh, after this live event uh, also europe is a wonderful place to travel and the visa which you get it's the schengen visa okay and that schengen visa you can use it while traveling entire in entire euro so this is one of the major advantage of coming to germany so uh how will your life look after you uh, after you are done with your studies okay life after your studies so basically talking about the salaries they you know they largely depend upon uh like the location your position your experience uh, and so on so basically approximately if you talk the salaries are uh, like 55000 euros to 60000 euros uh, in germany uh, these are again the average salaries it again depends upon the location it again depends upon your position your work experience the company how big it is and so on uh, you become a german citizen after 7 years okay so you come here you study for two uh, you study for two years for your masters after which you do a job for two years you can apply for pr so pr is the permanent residency okay so you can apply for pr after which after five more years of you staying in germany you get a citizenship german citizenship and you hold a german passport which is highly regarded in uh, entire world so uh, yes then Uh, as i said earlier you have you can travel across europe so uh, with the schengen visa you can explore about 145 different countries uh, and you are entitled with uh, many benefits like health insurances and other social benefits uh, then talking about masters okay i think so major majorly many people here are uh, for masters am am i hanging sorry sorry for the bad connection i hope i'm back so for masters the procedure looks like yeah there might be some network issue uh, saikat das sorry for that uh, but i i will upload this video you can again rewatch it if you miss some important part so i was talking about masters how the process looks basically i will suggest that please don't uh, look for like Uh, go behind behind like university ranking like tu munich or rwdh aachen it's not like that in germany all universities are best universities okay the reason behind that is the uh, quality of education throughout uh, germany it is the same okay so for example uh, rwdh aachen tu bochum are both great universities but uh, you know the reason is that in india you have the ranking system here you don't have any ranking system but still you can apply for any uh, any universities of your choice i will suggest that focus on the course you are taking okay not just the university so uh, first and the foremost the step is that you shortlist universities okay shortlist at least 10 courses uh, according to your interest then uh, then you when you shortlist courses you come to know about the course requirements 
then according to the course requirements i will suggest that you guys start preparing for exams for example you shortlist 10 courses then you go through the requirement of each and every course and then you decide whether you are uh, like you are going to uh, require ilts or whether, whether you are going to require gre and so on so uh, after shortlisting courses the uh, prepare according to the course requirement what people do usually they uh, usually what they do is that they give gre they give gmat they give ilts and then they shortlist courses and they find that oh gre was not needed so you waste your time your efforts and your money so i will suggest that please first focus on shortlisting courses and then prepare for your exams after that when you shortlist courses you apply the applications are of two types there are either direct applications or second thing is that you can apply through uni assist i will schedule another live event uh, for all these minute details but just for now uh, as you have carried your pen paper i hope or maybe you can note it on your mobile uh, first thing shortlist courses second as per the course requirements start preparing for exams for documents for transcripts and so on uh, generally you know generally speaking germany is a decentralized country so each and every university has different requirements okay so for example, RWDH Aachen has different requirements, TU Bochum has different uh, requirements. So it's not like a specific requirements for all the universities. Okay. After, uh, after preparing your documentation, you start applying through UniAssist or direct website, after which you, are, uh, you can uh, get some responses. And after the positive response, hopefully, uh, then you can start preparing for uh, your visa, your blocked account, then uh, your loans actually we help for a uh, blocked account we help you for uh, loans as well so uh, what i will say that please join our whatsapp group i've pinned it in the chat please check out the group and please join it for further updates uh, after that when you come to germany you know it is it is said by most of the students or people living here that getting an admission in german universities is a bit uh, you know, easier than getting an accommodation. <laughs> I'm, I'm kidding, but uh, seriously, guys, getting an uh, accommodation is quite challenging here. Uh, for that, there are many websites. You can note it down. It's Vege Gezukt first, then Immo Scout, uh, Immo Scout 24, uh, and so on. So basically, I will also have a separate event for accommodations, how to find accommodations. If when you get an admit, so I will suggest that you guys just directly uh, register for student dorms. Uh, it is a cheaper option. It is affordable. And uh, also, you know, there are many students living uh, nearby you. So you, uh, you don't feel alone because you're coming alone here from India and you, you, uh, you guys can feel alone. So that's why I will suggest that. Uh, there are student dorms available and you register for it as soon as you get an uh, admit. Uh, there are huge waiting lists because like uh, the general time period of, uh, you know, getting a dorm is almost one year. So when you book for a dorm, you get a dorm after one year. So this is usually the time. Uh, then talking about Indian, uh, Indian food available here. Yes, there are Indian shops available. Especially in Aachen or Bochum, Dresden, yes, there are uh, many Indian shops. Not many, but yeah, two to three, at least two to three Indian shops available here. So, uh, like the groceries, Indian groceries are available here. So that's not a problem. Uh, yes, I will go through most of your questions, and then let's see how this life goes. For now, uh, for new students, please join our community how to convert ECTS from India to uh, German standard. Uh, okay, so basically there are, uh, the ECTS thing is that there are one uh, for three year course, three year bachelor course in uh, in India, the ECTS is calculated as 180. And for four year bachelor course, it is uh, like 210 ECTS. So uh, I will suggest that uh, 
it depends upon the university okay so in the university requirements once you shortlist the courses in the university requirements it is mentioned that how much uh, how much credits ects european credits they require hey what is the scope of geology in germany for masters uh, vijay yes actually uh, talking about uh, geology yes uh, it is uh, th there are uh, there is a scope uh, for example in uh, dortmund or uh, like cities like cologne domain okay irrespective of domain germany has been uh, you know expanding into various domains not only mechanical or not only engineering stuff but management or maybe uh, doctor nurse uh, and so on so uh, if you if you want more information you can join our whatsapp group uh, in which you can get my uh, contact details and you can message me personally i can answer your question in more detail uh, next question is how to convert okay i have answered this if someone have backlogs in the first year of engineering still is he eligible to apply for germany for bachelors okay so i i explained the procedure procedure for masters okay so for bachelors it is a bit different most of the courses in bachelor uh, bachelors are in german language so you have to uh, you have to go uh, and learn german language first at least b1 and then apply for a student curriculum course okay so there is a course where in uh, german language is taught and then uh, after that you will get an admit after you complete your student curriculum course so for bachelors it's a bit dif uh, different but backlogs yes they don't matter uh, at all because as i said the universities they consider your entire application and not just your marks okay how well you have written your sop your lor uh, then how how well you have done your extracurricular activities maybe sports or uh, maybe some internships practicum how well you have written your cv all things matter uh, okay next question okay backlog thing i have answered i am a food technology btech how can i apply uh how can i get job in germany uh, to be honest uh, getting a job in germany it's quite challenging when you don't have a german degree uh, still you can apply uh, i'll suggest you few things uh, here the cover letter comes into picture how well you write your uh, letter of motivation like why do you want a particular job uh, you can look in on linkedin i personally recommend linkedin because uh, you know uh, there you you might find some uh, english speaking jobs and i i like the portal and the uh, user interface to be uh, to be honest so i use linkedin for uh, job applications so you can filter uh, based on your city based on your location based on your position experience and so on so linkedin is a wonderful platform so you can absolutely check linkedin otherwise like there are some traditional approaches like uh, glassdoor nokri.com or maybe uh, nokri.com is for india but uh, glassdoor uh, job menza mind practicum only for internships and uh, there are uh, like the company website of course aditya utpath aditya utpath is my best friend okay hi aditya uh there are business admin ect is required and my current bachelor's degree doesn't uh, contain any credits can i compensate uh for those ects by completing a particular course uh yes aditya uh, to answer your question uh basically in universities if your application is uh, like really interesting but your credits are not uh, good enough or you're lacking like a few credits uh then the university will send you some uh, send you some test okay which you have to clear or maybe a course the university will, uh, will recommend you or else uh, you can also uh, check courses on coursera upgrad regarding your uh, application uh, regarding your uh, scope of application uh, for example computer science as you are applying for computer science or management degree uh, you can do some related courses and you can upload the certificate while applying to the universities which will uh, carry a weightage i hope you i have answered your question hey bro i want to pursue my masters in germany that's great i will please guide me okay so death throne okay d throne okay so uh, for that please uh, join our whatsapp group okay uh our whatsapp group i shared the link uh, and i hope that link is working properly 
because this youtube live link uh, you know i don't know i have come uh, like this is my first time coming live so there was some mess there so you can join our whatsapp group and i will surely guide you no worries also if you guys have a question you can check the description uh, you can book a one on one call with me so that i can evaluate your profile and if you have more questions i can answer them could you tell me about student house building okay yes so for house building uh, it is like you study as well as you work uh, like it is it is similar to our uh, what we do here in india like the sandwich course so it is similar to house building but uh, talking about house building it is like mostly in german language the studies which you do is in german language so if you guys are interested to uh, you know to join the german language class as well i will share you my uh, the link for my website and you can you can send an inquiry for german language class as well give me a uh, like few seconds i will this is the link yes i have also uh, the link is in the description so you can check it out भैया मैंने भाई सवाल नहीं समझा ओके फूड टेक्नोलॉजी मास्टर्स हाउ टू अप्लाई सो एज अ सेट यू शॉर्टलिस्ट सम कोर्सेस एटलीस्ट टेन बिकॉज यू नो इफ यू शॉर्टलिस्ट वन और टू कोर्सेस देन इट इज अ बिट यू नो रिस्कियर आई विल से बिकॉज इफ यू आर रिजेक्टेड फ्रॉम दैट वन और टू कोर्सेज देन uh you again search for courses which is tiring so the first task is shortlist at least 10 courses 10 is a good sample uh, sample size so yes shortlist 10 courses and according to the requirements you start preparing for the documents and then you can apply either uh, via their online website or uni assist what is the cost for masters in public universities a very good question so uh, talking about the cost uh most of the public universities like 99% of the public universities they offer free course okay the, so you don't need, uh, don't need to pay uh for your what we say the tuition fees but uh, there are some semester contributions in which uh you know there are uh, there are various costs incurred so it is usually 300 euros per semester and the costs which are included in that 300 euros is uh your portal uh for example in my case the rwth portal uh secondly uh the semester ticket the semester ticket is like this ticket wherein you can uh you can explore the entire state okay in my case i was in rwth and uh the semester ticket was valid for entire north rhine westphalia so this this state so you can if you are uh, if you love traveling then you can uh of course use that semester ticket uh after that uh, another thing which is uh, included is there are some uh, various other contributions so 300 euros per semester for masters in public universities bhaiya ek video banaiye what are the prerequisites for going abroad for ects okay engineer ece engineer okay electronics electronics and टेलीकम्युनिकेशन ओके भाई जरूर बताऊंगा आशुतोष कुमार सिंह जरूर बताऊंगा काउंसिलर डिमांड में एक लाख अरेंजिंग एडमिशन इन जर्मनी इज इट वर्दी आई विल से पेइंग वन लाख रुपीस इज नॉट अ गुड ऑप्शन बिकॉज इफ यू इफ यू ट्राई टू फिगर आउट थिंग्स योरसेल्फ इट इज डूएबल यस यू रिक्वायर सम गाइडेंस बट यू नो पेइंग Uh, one lakh rupees is not the thing at least i i would do not at all okay gavin gavin bhai humne whatsapp pe baat kiya hai should our lom be different for different universities or can we uh, make single generic lom no actually to answer this question your lom should be specific okay lom is what your letter of motivation why do you want to pursue that course so uh, this lom thing it is completely uh, different for different universities also for jobs for internship application here 
it will depend upon your position it will depend upon your post okay so for example if you consider for universities it will depend upon the course okay it will depend upon the university because you have to explain uh, why you are interested in that particular university so it is different uh, yes your experience paragraph then your uh, extracurricular paragraph yes it remains uh, same but uh, it will again depend upon the university in particular study and is it for okay how to apply for part time jobs with study okay uh, is it affordable for expenditure yes absolutely so now uh, i will brief you through some of the costs incurred while uh, you are living in germany so as a student uh, when i was living in aachen my monthly expenses was around uh, 700 euros maybe so including everything so i am a type of person who you know uh, like home cooked food and so like i bring groceries and prepare food on my own most of the times uh, also apart from that the rent was around 300 euros uh, the groceries were around 120 euros and uh, the next thing is your health insurance which will be around uh, 111 euros apart from that uh, your mobile internet it will be around 20 30 euros and that's it so if you have any other cost that like may be 50 euros more so it will be around like 600 euros to 700 euros maximum but it will depend upon the location for example in munich if you go for like there are single rooms available for like 600 euros as well in that case the costs will be entirely different but for now uh, if you if you are thinking for general costs it will be around 700 euros you can consider and the blocked account is like uh it is around 9.5 lakhs or 10 lakh rupees uh, each year for first year you have to show one uh, like 10 lakh rupees and for uh, next year you have to again show 10 lakh rupees or else you can show a contract okay a working contract so for new students please you can subscribe my channel if you uh, find this useful i will be uh, having more frequent live lives uh, live streams and also you can join our whatsapp group the link is pinned in the comments and you can check out all the links in description as well uh talking about part time jobs yes there are various part time jobs okay for example you can do some cleaning jobs you can do uh, jobs in hotel burger star burger king or maybe pizza hut dominos and stuff like that uh, you are paid around like 10 euros 10.5 euros per hour it's r per hour uh, so and as a student you are allowed to work around 20 20 hours per week so it's like uh, 20 into 4 80 hours per uh, month and 80 into 10 euros 800 euros so 800 euros is your salary minimum uh, monthly salary and your expenses around like 600 to 700 euros so you not only cover up your expenses but you also save money okay so 200 euros you are saving and if you get internship then uh, the salary is like 1500 euros okay how to apply for part time jobs i i answered this question okay how to apply so basically there are some agencies here you can go and bang their doors uh, directly with your resume or maybe no resume is required but you can ask them for job uh, part time job so in arkham there is uh, there is a famous agency like sequences and and x time so when you come to arkan you will come to know so uh, that agency is provide you uh, part time jobs in a uh, famous chocolate factory in arkan which is the lind chocolate factory so apart from this you can also check out websites like uh, uh, job menza and uh, mind practicum but i will suggest that instead of focusing on part time jobs you directly apply for uh, you know uh, internships and working student jobs Uh, so internships and working students uh, regarding that i will prepare a se separate live so don't worry i hope i hope yes gavin has got his answer thanks gavin prasad ahire okay how to find accommodation in germany uh, prasad ahire is actually in germany but okay still i have answered this question i will save this live and you can again go through it bhaiya ek aur sawal ek saal ka kitna 
लगता है जर्मनी में सो so, एक एक साल का ब्लॉक अकाउंट भाई कम से कम साढ़े नौ लाख मान के चलो इट डिपेंड इट डिपेंड्स अपॉन द रेट द यूरो रेट ओके सो मान के चलो एक साल का साढ़े नौ से दस लाख रुपए लगता है लेकिन आप यहाँ पे आओगे और पार्ट टाइम जॉब करोगे तो कोई भी प्रॉब्लम नहीं है यू कैन इजिली सेंड योर ब्लॉक अकाउंट मनी बैंक सो यहाँ पे आर काफी अच्छा है वॉट अबाउट रेट इन्फ्लेशन साहिल भाई ये तो इट्स वर्ल्ड वाइड प्रॉब्लम नॉट इन नॉट ओनली इन जर्मनी ओके भैया ओके भाई देर हैव एनी देर हैव एनी एग्जाम फॉर जर्मन ओके देर आर एनी एग्जाम्स ओके यस देर आर एग्जाम्स हियर फॉर बी वन यस अप टू बी वन यू कैन गिव एग्जाम्स uh basically you can go uh, through goethe and there are other uh, other uh, agencies as well but i will suggest that goethe is the best option if you guys want to uh, want to learn german language you can join our whatsapp group and you can uh, then you can contact me or you can ask on the group and we can guide you for german language as well you can check the link in the description wherein you can book Uh, a slot for german language classes as well all the details are mentioned there uh, are there any construction project uh, project management courses civil in germany uh, i have gone through dard website and couldn't find any so uh, kirthi to answer this question construction project management it is a very specific domain uh, but maybe like uh, what i will suggest if it is not that like the course uh, in particular i can i will suggest that you can find some similar courses as well on dart so if you are not that uh, specific because management domain is a bit you know bhaiya ek video banaiye full fledged how to go abroad for any student bhai zarur banaunga zarur banaunga also give me ideas for next youtube videos i will be working on my youtube channel i know i have been lazy but i still you know try to be consistent but ye live events consistently karenge tension mat lo uh aniruddha joshi namaskar baba namaskar uh i want to go for jan intake may okay for me okay jan intake uh, is the right uh, time for you i will say i will say because uh, right now you can start applying it will take you know it's not like uh, one or two days for preparing documents one or two days for writing your cv sop l or it takes time so you can try for january of course you can apply for courses but be prepared for the next uh, intake as well the visa issuance situation is very bad right now what do you suggest uh actually i will suggest please wait patiently also uh, the universities here they know the situation uh, currently in the world or in mainly in india so yes actually the situation is uh, really bad i will say but there is no shortcut maybe you can find some visa agents which will take huge money but i don't have any contacts with any of such agents bhaiya next video for masters program banaunga zarur banaunga actually dhanyawad dhanyawad actually uh, this i'm i'm planning to uh, you know come live once a week for answering all your general questions and specific videos i will be i will be coming uh, live on sunday what do you guys say also give me some ideas guys i want your inputs for next videos for uh, for example yes masters part time jobs i will i will be i have one video on part time jobs so it is i think so it is uh, a good guide for you uh, i have i've also mentioned all the links in the description of that video you can check it out part time jobs it's in the playlist as well incoming stu- students should watch it so the playlist name is incoming students should watch it bhaiya banking ka kya scene hai waha banking course ki baat kar rahe ho ya banking ka okay job uh, to be honest like i will not uh, 
sound too positive because i should be like realistic or uh, banking jobs or maybe like management jobs uh, or uh, doctors lawyers in uh, doctors lawyers nurses these kinds of uh, jobs they require german language skill okay so you have to have good german language skills and we uh, we help you in uh, like learning german if you want to check out you can drop a message on whatsapp group or maybe check uh, the link in the description to book a call with me so in that you have many options we great keep keep up the spirit thanks vijay bhai aise hi to motivation chahiye good i want to pursue my masters on loan how can i get it yes we help you for loans so basically there are two types of loans collateral and non collateral uh it it depends upon how much uh, loan you require and who is your uh, sponsor and actually to be honest i don't know in detail but we have tie ups uh, with people uh, who can guide you better so if you want if you are looking for loans then also join our whatsapp group and ping me uh, there yes bhaiya sunday is best day bhai time bhi batao saturday sunday which is the best time for you guys because now like around like 15 20 students or maybe 20 people join the this live event uh but you can let me know the time as well okay any other questions i hope i have answered all the questions यस यस भाई आशुतोष भाई टाइम भी बताओ टाइम क्या चाहिए आपको सुबह या फिर दोपहर को शाम को वो भी बताओ सो फॉर न्यू पीपल आई विल ऑल्सो पिंक द लिंक जस्ट गिव मी अ सेकेंड for wherein you can see various options mm, just a minute i'll share the link and you can check this link out as well mm. where is the link yes this is the link i will be dropping in the chat and you guys can check it out this time is perfect perfect okay bhai yay so in the pin uh, in the pin comment i have pin uh, a comment just now and you can just check it uh if you want german language classes you can uh check check it out then we provide you health insurance blocked account and loan as well we help you in that for masters as well for bachelors as well for phd as well uh counselor analysis okay abhi ha huh. vijay is asking uh कम स्टूडेंट्स ज्वाइन हो रहे हैं तो ही अच्छा रहता है डाउट्स अच्छे से यस रिजॉल्व हो रहे यस भाई माना मैंने सही बात है सही बात है लेकिन आई विल लाइक इफ लाइक मे बी इन फ्यूचर व्हेन स्टूडेंट्स इंक्रीज देन आल्सो आई विल ट्राई टू आंसर ऑल योर क्वेश्चंस इफ आई एम नॉट एबल टू आंसर योर क्वेश्चन देन यू कैन श्योरली बुक अ कॉल विद अस और मे बी इन व्हाट्सएप ग्रुप यू कैन आस्क डेफिनेटली counselor analyze my profile and they said they they can provide me semi private college that cost 4 lakhs per semester and they also said you have 9 lakh rupees of blocked account these facts are true yes uh, so private university usually they cost tuition fees uh, i will suggest guys actually ye jo free education uh, free education jo hai it's a buzzword according to me 
so rather than focusing on free education and you know trying to uh, save money i will suggest that if the course is really interesting if you see your future in that course if you see future jobs job opportunities there then i will suggest that uh, you can also opt for private or semi private uh, rather than public universities going into public university free education uh, in the course which doesn't you know suit you or maybe you are not interested in that course that i will not suggest rather pay some money and do the things which interest you uh has the blocked account amount increased uh yes actually it is increased it has been increasing since like uh, two years so i think so it is like uh, 11000 euros oh uh, so uh the throne yes actually uh i will say that the overall cost if you go for like private universities it will be around Uh, 20 lakh rupees yes okay you guys can also check out my uh, other videos i uh, especially uh, made some good videos about uh, for incoming students to germany you can check out that playlist as well as you guys can uh, check out my travel vlogs so that you can just see how beautiful germany really is semi private uh, yes bro it will not it will not exceed more than like 20 20 lakh rupees according to me it will again depend upon the tuition fees but yeah according to my experience are student dorms available for summer intake uh, so for this question uh, really it depends upon the uh, university you are applying so student dorms you are in waiting lists already so as soon as you get an admit i will suggest that please you check out uh, like register for student dorms in that particular university yes prasad thanks for attending by the way i yes so i have answered this question already like ielts compulsory or gre compulsory gmat compulsory it depends upon the university requirements so please don't start preparing for ielts unless and until you have shortlisted the courses so first step is shortlisting the courses going through the course requirements and after that figuring out whether ielts is required or not but for like 90% of the universities i will say that i ielts is compulsory or either the, there is one more option like a uh, medium of instruction ms in computer science uh so are you planning for ms in yes for ms in computer science yes mostly ielts will be required uh but you shortlist courses on like there are various websites uh dart.d and many other things like but mainly you can check it on uh dart.d okay any other questions website name okay i will drop it in the chat card dot and if it is it opens in german language then you can simply use uh, translate to english by right clicking it okay so yeah i got 
quite a few interesting questions. Many people have joined our group as well. So let me check. Okay. Paraplegic, paralyzed in the lower half, linear and use a wheelchair. Do you think I can come to Germany for masters? So Varun, uh, yes, you can surely come. Uh, so for specially able uh, people, uh, Germany is a wonderful uh, city because you have uh, access like to uh, everything here. So they have uh, slopes maintained for shopping malls. So slopes maintained on the footpath. So on the stairs as well. So yes, you can also come to uh, pursue your masters in Germany. Absolutely. So yes, you can you can check out uh, uh, my website here, and you can either uh, enroll for our German language classes or maybe for uh, any other questions if you have. Good evening from India. Good afternoon from Germany. How good is MMA time program from job perspective? Do all get job? Uh, mechanical engineering concepts. So to be honest, I have done an MMA time course from RWDH Akram and I have got job. So I will, I will say that yes, you get a job, but uh, to be honest, you have to really uh, work hard because it is not like a cakewalk. So you have to be consistent in your applications, but surely you will land up uh, in in a job so don't worry uh, focus on your skills focus on uh, your uh, applications and yes you can really make it If you want to uh, evaluate, if you want me to evaluate your profile or any specific questions, then you can check uh, out the website and you can book a call with me. Uh, we can evaluate your profile as well. Computer science in US versus computer science in Germany. Uh, so John is asking, uh, to be honest, like computer science is a field which is booming throughout the world right now. Uh, and like in US, I don't uh, have a fair idea, to be honest, but here in Germany, yes, computer science is a booming uh, sector. So uh, regarding the job opportunities, uh, I will say that German language is a benefit when it comes to computer science as well, because the colleagues there, they are speaking in German language in the company and most of the meetings, they are in German language, unless and until it is a multinational uh, big company wherein the uh, spoken language is English. So I will say that start, if you are interested in coming to Germany, start learning German language as soon as possible. For that, you can check uh, the website, which I pinned here, and you can uh, inquire for uh, our German language classes. We can, we can help you in that. Sure, thanks. Yes, thanks. Thanks, Keith Patel. So like more five minutes are remaining. If you have any questions, you can ask me, then I can surely, we can call it a day for today. But I'm planning for more lives. So stay tuned. Okay. Any other question? So for new people, please, uh, if you like this video, this live stream, if you found some value, please leave like 
to this uh, live stream also please subscribe to my youtube channel and i promise you that i will come live more frequently and upload content more frequently so thanks for it when you are planning for india when are you planning for india uh maybe just december i am planning to come to india i will i will stay uh, i will keep you updated my youtube family i will surely keep you updated bro nice information today thanks will ping on whatsapp yes sure you can ping me on whatsapp i like i get tons of messages i will say that please bear with me if i don't reply or miss some messages i know you are uh, you will understand it does education in germany open doors for jobs worldwide uh yes actually uh, to be honest the degree which you get in uh, germany it is recognized worldwide so yes uh, you can uh, apply for jobs worldwide but currently like uh, looking at my experience if you are if you get a job in germany uh, i i am 100% sure that you will not go anywhere because of the work life balance and the quality of a uh, life here and the quality of work here so will not go anywhere but yes surely you can you can apply for degree or uh, like for jobs worldwide okay okay i think so we are nearing to the end of this live stream i hope you enjoyed this live stream and if you have any further questions join our whatsapp community subscribe to my youtube channel i am planning to you know uh, get involved into more live streams in the future so to answer all your questions and i hope to okay is it possible to get research internship yes it depends upon your profile uh, and when you study here in germany then it is really comparatively easy rather than coming directly from india thank you guys thank you for attending see you please subscribe to my channel and see you in the next live stream and next videos so thanks for attending bye and